Hey, today we wanted to talk about Deandria. This is a neighborhood in Sparks. It is not too far out where a lot of the Sparks neighborhoods kind of get far from the freeway, so sometimes they're hard to find. But I have my friend on today, Aaron Schiller. She lives in Deandria. Deandria is an area that most of the homes are, I would say, 30 years or newer. I think there's some that are probably pushing 30 years now. And you have many different options down at the lower end. There's some patio homes on some tight lots. And as you go up, there used to be an 18-hole golf course. The golf course completely went away for, I don't know, 10 years at least. And then all of a sudden now there's nine holes golf course back. So we were sitting here talking about DeAndrea and the pros and cons of living in DeAndrea. So we're going to get an expert who actually lives there right now and get her thoughts and opinions on, on what she knows about that particular area. So I moved uh, to DeAndrea in 2002. I'm actually an original property owner. One of the reasons we moved there was one, it's right off the freeway. I can get on the freeway within less than five minutes. I mean, even at high traffic. Been, yes. Okay. So that's one of the things that was great about it. And it was really close to schools, which was even better. So we were golfers. And so we were like, okay, this is great. We've got this beautiful view. So I have a beautiful view of the, all the way from Mount Rose to Spanish Springs and great lot. I mean, it's just, it was amazing. We moved there and then a few years later, the golf course went out. And so we stayed just because for our daughter's sake. And also we were just saying like, we're going to hang in there because let's see what happens. And so what happened was they ended up getting a new investor. They've turned it around. There's now nine holes. They have a driving range. And it's just, it's beautiful. And they've done a great job. There's a lot of development up there, though, right? And it's new, crazy. New construction stuff going on. Yes, up at the new top construction, end it, right? yeah. There's still a lot of building and developing. The one thing I love, too, is it's right next to grocery store. There's walking paths. It's kind of a kind of a hidden gem, and well, a lot of people don't look at it. Right. I would say DeAndrea kind of reminds me a little bit of Hidden Valley, even though Hidden Valley is more. It's like, if you don't turn into DeAndrea and you're driving on Vista, you drive right past it, you wouldn't really even pay attention to what's going on up there. And when you come up those main roads, there's quite a few houses up there that have views. I think people think of all the views in our area as homes that are in South Reno that are up on the hill. They don't realize there are quite a few areas in Sparks that get views going back the other way. And then you get downtown and the mountain views at the same time. So you kind of get both, but it is sort of a hidden little spot. And again, it's not too far out and you can still find pretty good prices in there. Yeah, you can. I mean, we bought our home for 292000 back in 2002 and now they're going for over 600000 So, I mean, it, it kind of depends on the property, but it's beautiful. I mean, it's... And one of the things I love about the neighborhood, it's quiet. There's a lot of long-term homeowners there. So there's a lot of people that haven't moved. They're, they're staying, one, to retire out or they're just because of their children being able to walk to the schools. That was one of the things... My daughter could walk to the elementary school, the middle school. She could even, well, walk to read, but I didn't want her to do that. I'd drive her. It's still close. It's just barely it's too far, but it's close, yeah. right? Yeah, it's clean. The community's great. The HOA has done a great job of keeping it just pristine and beautiful, and they do a great job up there. So I, I love being in Deanna. Well, I tell people down on the lower section of it where there's those, pat I call them patio homes because they're on kind of shared lots and they're on small acreage. It's still affordable. You can get in there if you were somebody that had younger kids and maybe couldn't afford to be in the middle or higher area in DeAndre where it gets a little more expensive. But again, everything is still relatively new. In some ways, I tell people the housing up there is similar to what you might see in the South Meadows area in Double Diamond Damani, but it's just much more of a hidden gem and it is super close to everything. So for even for people that live in DeAndrea and you were hopping on the freeway and going out to USA Parkway and working all those jobs out there, none of it is that far. And with the connector getting you to South Reno, I've always kind of felt like it was sort of a hidden gem. And now that there are golf holes back, even if it ends up just being the nine, I think it definitely helps there because we saw the same thing happen in Northwest when Northgate Golf Course went away. And it's amazing how quickly it goes from looking like a beautiful golf course to this desert landscape. And they do a nice job of it, but then you'll be like, there's a cart path going through the desert. It just seemed kind of odd and weird. It's like I said, it's one of these little areas I think that people don't even know about. One of the things that is also wonderful is the fact that we have Northern Nevada Medical Center there. Right. You know, you've got right down the street. all the amenities, like, mm -hmm. you know, and like you said, we've we've got an office in Fernley. And if anybody is, you know, working in the Fernley market or going out to Trick, that's a great place to live. Most people move out to Wingfield Springs or some of those other areas out in Spanish Springs, but the DeAndrea market has been just a, a great place to live for us. Well, and again, there's a 55 and over community there too. I have a couple of clients who live there, which is great for them because you're right, it is close to Northern Nevada Medical Center, which is kind of up on the hill that when it first got built, it used to kind of sit up there by itself. And now there's houses built all up and around and all that. And the nice part, like you said, is there are parts of Sparks, if you live further out off of either Pyramid Highway or Sparks Boulevard or Vista, that if you're an eight to five, that traffic can be kind of an issue. 
but from D'Andrea, it is not because you're really close to the freeway. You literally drive right by where my son happens to live really close there too, so he's even closer to the freeway. And he loves living over there because it's it's easy access to everything, it's close to everything. And like we've talked about in so many other videos, these are sort of these hidden areas that people don't realize. They always just think of Reno, Tahoe, and they don't even realize most of them. If I drove them around, they wouldn't even know where Reno started and Spark started. It all sort of runs together and it's like I tell you, it's one county, it's one school district. And for those of you that are looking for maybe a spot that's not too far out, that's like you just said, all the things you've mentioned, it's actually a really great place to live. So if you're looking for specific information about DeAndrea, we'd be happy to get you that. Get you some specifics on housing and things in there. And there are options, like I said, new construction options up there as well, depending on what your price points are and what you can afford. So just know it's a really good area. We just want to tell you a little bit about DeAndrea as we're talking about some of the other areas in this community. And Erin lives there, so she's firsthand able to tell you uh, what it's like to live there. So we appreciate you watching today's video. Please hit the bell, subscribe to the channel if you're enjoying the content we're putting out there. And we appreciate you watching another video on our channel. Have a great day.